Hello and welcome back to another episode of Lamplighter's League. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of uh, Lamplighter's League on the hardest difficulty. We are regaining a bit of momentum. Nicastro <coughs> isn't doing anything this week, which is exactly why we're going to hit Strum with the Hall of Conquest, a heist setup which we're going to use our typical three i think that's a nice little uh, mission setup and i think we're good we're good to go let's jump into the mission all right ain't no doubt about that come on let's find evidence of this lost tomb and get out of here very nice to the victor go the spoils. Okay. Lights out. Sometimes a two for one is as good as it gets. Are we using our abilities for that? No, I think we're just literally going to attack this guy. I hate the clingy ones. Right on the money. Very good. Move out. Saves us an ability. We got an ether. A trophy hall? Is this entire museum not enough? Okay, this is where we're going to use our abilities. Hey, what's that over there? Sleep well. Very good. One, two, three. And he moves here. One, two, three, four. Skip that yeah. target. These were the burning mummies, if I'm recalling correctly. Nah, we don't want to explode ourselves. You're on my list now, partner. Good. More AP. Here. Thirty armor. Wow, that's a lot.
Well, maybe not that much. Nice little stick and move. Uh, knock down. Fantastic. Moves up to here. Hopefully not triggering more. Egyptian wing. Sounds promising. You blinked. Good, we're positioning ourselves right in the middle here so that we can reach all of them. It is the only way. Oh, I have forgotten about that guy. Alright, kill. Another kill. Yet another kill. We can make them explode. Blinded, but not knocked it down. You won't hurt anyone anymore. Very good. Cooldowns reduced. Forgive me. Cooldowns even further reduced, and Eddie, what are we going to do with you? Still dazes the mummy, so that it can't get up. Buffalo Bill, eat your heart out. We're taking some burning damage, but that's okay, I guess. Alright, the mummy finally, finally made it up. Just be just making sure I want uh, the burning to be completely gone. I think we already cleansed it before. Gonna teach you to tangle with Eddie Sawyer. And that is that. Let's move. Okay, with the exception of taking that one fire burning, that was a very, very solid um, first start to the mission. Medical kit two. Should be of interest to lock. Into.
That will do. Not bad. I'll take it. Ooh, Seric Steel, are you kidding me? It's just casually laying around here? No way. Oh, that was really awesome loot. There's always an advantage of going through the entirety of the rooms. That's another weapon upgrade right there. Not a bad hand. There is the moat, more ether. Do my eyes deceive me? That looks like a map. This is a map pointing straight to the tomb of the everlasting. Strom really should have burnt this. A souvenir. Wow. Okay. This is one of, of the fire. best loot areas that, that I've seen so far. So me. much intel ether, the ceramic steel, I've never seen that as a loot. But maybe as the game progresses it becomes more common, who knows. Yeah, complete and utter surprise, I know. I was about to say, this looks like a setup. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Well, I regret to inform you that you unfortunately this are within my that was incredible. my line of sight, so you're going to get all of the hate. And what's red yeah, just start continue. Very good. These guys are dazed, dazed on the ground. Doesn't look good for them. One, we two, have righteousness on thank our side. you. Buff you. Here. And set this guy up for kill. Eddie. Hit. And hit. All right, let's have some fun. That's one kill into another kill. 
have to go and make things unpleasant. Into stick and move because we want to get over. These two are taken out, so no point in continuing to hammer them into the ground. I charge extra for this. Hey, save some for me, will you? Your name's on my dance card. Nice little knockdown. Another Easier bonus kill. In love. These guys are getting stressed out, which I can understand. Guess what? No one can act. <laughs> ridiculous. Our team setup is absolutely ridiculous. down I'm one more down face. no hard feelings and Get one more down Eddie moves over. I'm just getting warmed up. More ammo shred, more crit, more everything. It had to be done. Good. Next round we can finally go with the cooldowns again. One less to worry down. about. Nice little push kick. And another push kick. Now you know your place. the dust easy our dance is done 
The ingrid moves up. And... We are moving further up as well. Take this. More guards incoming. Not so fast. Okay, it seems they really want us to leave. Easier than falling out of love. And I'm fine with uh, just running. Apparently, we are not supposed to clean this up. Okay, let's see, can we, hmm, potentially, that should hit both of them, You're in my way. well, one goes down, the other doesn't, fair enough. Stay away from me. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Light him up. Chance to daze them. Good hit. Cavalry's coming. I mean, we would be able to kill all of those, but I'm not sure if. Uh, we would be able to kill further enemies afterwards.
Good. Yeah, they're just running and running and running. Whilst being on fire. Soul Strum's tomb of the everlasting, and we will take his red sulfur whether he likes it or not. Cool. Didn't even get a stress break. Did not use any consumables. Just a clean mission. And we got ceramic steel. That's a very, very big bonus point. Okay, so 14 skill points. The game is really giving you more and more over time. After suffering stress break, that's bad. Grenade is bad. This is not bad. That's I like the blacksmith, but this here is even better. Can give the entire team speed. I think that's a decent um it is no accident buff ability. The rest is crap. Grenade or the hermit. You know what? Might as well take the grenade. Uncle Sam taught me six ways to kill a guy with my bare hands. Now this we can act on. Very good. Wolfram Strom. The man who built the Hall of Conquest is an old money aristocrat in a strong man's body. His red sulfur gives him a strange power over life and death. <laughs> and now we know where he hides it. What did you find out there? You have an eye for talent. Cool. So we got a new mission. What's a new agent? Fabulous. Strum is taking some more locations, which is what I was hoping for. That means the Castro can't just continue her way uh, to 40 victory points. Uh, we're reducing the Castro, yes, thank you. And we got whom? Judith, the new agent. Okay, cool. Also known as Cooldeth. Stay sharp. Handle this discreetly. Good. Look. Marto would make progress. Don't like it. A 
but this here would help us quite a bit. Yeah, it's an acceptable loss. I think progressing the storyline further is what needs to happen. More Seric Steel. In terms of agents, this here would increase her hit and crit chance and it give her more ammo. So basically everything that uh, she was uh, would be dreaming of. There we go. Which means our standard team is fully upgraded. Like all of them. We have uh, reached the peak of our strengths, unless we get better cards. As for Purnima, this would be good. This would be good. This would be good. I'm not so fast about her invisibility. And lockdown 3 is fine because she can uh, hit two enemies, I guess. That's okay. Because it doubles the amount of lockdown uh, shots. So, yeah, that's not bad. Specifically since she has a lot of range. And if the zone now is bigger, let's see. What is I'm not it going to seat? be too excited before I Let's see it in action. Make a deal. So That's a good mod, also for the sniper, but we have given her the ammunition mod. Is there anything that we can upgrade on the agents? Vitality gear 2. I think he has vitality gear 1. Is Vitality Gear 2 worth it? The 450. I mean, it's pretty damn good. 30 more hit points. And it seems we're at the point in the game where there isn't that much more that you can get. Body armor isn't bad either. I definitely would want to give her more crit because so that's a higher chance that she reduces her cooldowns. Mm. Am I sticking with the satyr, uh, satyr? Because this would give everybody a bit more speed. And that sticks for two rounds. I think it's a good upgrade. Might as well do it. I would have liked to given her the whale. But it's okay. It's not the end of the day. He could also get the whale and we're still going to be fine. The serpent definitely good. He already has Forsaken. I mean, he needs a couple of more pass passive buffs. The dodging uh, might be good. The Serpent is good on him as well. That would be fantastic. The Storm on Eddie. Yeah, but we're also now getting way more ink than, we, than we've ever gotten before. All right, I think that's it for uh, this week. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Next time we are going to get more Seric Steel. 
and 14 skill points as we are getting strum Motto's Persephonite down and, the Castro's and then all we need possession. is another Only keystone red sulfur remains. and that looks quite good I mean we're at week number 30 soon so I guess it's the end of the game very very soon thanks for watching as always take care and if you enjoy the content please leave a comment and a like down below and see you in the next episode bye bye